What's up guys, Kevin over at Leg Bros coming back at you with another video today. I have ordered so much stuff lately and haven't had time to go through it that uh, I have just an enormous pile <laughs> of boxes and bags uh, at my house. So I'm just going to go ahead and break these up into a couple videos just so they're not super, super, super long. Um, so we do have about five packages here today. Uh, depending on how long these take, then maybe I'll add some more. Um, but uh, if you do like this, go ahead and hit that like button. Hit the uh, subscribe, I would definitely appreciate that. And hit the little bell just to be notified for the next one because I'm going to be doing these quite frequently coming up here. Uh, I'm going to be taking a little vacation, but uh, should have some videos posted for that uh, time as well or scheduled to be posted for that time. So let's go ahead and get started. Uh, we'll start with just the little ones first. This one. These little packaging bags. <laughs> I can never figure them out. Looks like there's like five bags in one bag, which is really interesting. I think that will get to it. Jeez. This is why I cut some of them, the tape at least, just before I uh, start the videos, just so I don't have just like the whole time <laughs> trying to open the package itself. Um, so as we see here, and it's been so long I don't even remember what these were. Uh, but it looks like this one is all Indiana Jones, which is actually something that I haven't really featured on the channel quite often. Sometimes I find a couple of them in the random packs. But these are actually all Indiana Jones figures. Uh, a lot of the ones from Temple of Doom, which is actually the best um, Indiana Jones set in terms of minifigures. Uh, so I think it's the whole uh, Temple of Doom set. I don't remember exactly all of them. I know Mullah Ram and this guy, that one. Uh, they were all in it. I think some of these are the newer ones, like this guy. But as you can see, um, we do have one of the uh, guards and Mola Ram there. And these two guys. don't really remember their names. Um, of course, Indiana Jones. Can't forget that guy. Uh, I think this is a Ger Russian, German soldier. And then I don't remember his name either. And two tribesmen. And I don't remember her name. Don't know a whole lot of Indiana Jones because I don't do a whole lot of it, but uh, I did see the Temple of Doom set. I think this was only like 15 bucks or something like that for the whole thing. So uh, definitely going to do well on that. Uh, the next small one we had was this one. Ah. So this was just uh, two sets of the uh, ARF arc or AR. ARFs and ARCs, Ark and Arf Troopers, uh, from that battle pack. Looks like they're fully loaded uh, as well in terms of the gear. This looks like they just came out of the battle pack. I think they're brand new as well, uh, which is always nice. Just got two sets of them. It's one of my best sellers on the store. Oh, actually, he is not loaded. Okay, a little, <laughs> a little difference there. One has the armor, one does not. Uh, a little disappointing, but I think I have some armor uh, to use for that guy. So, um, two of those. This one, like I said, it's been so long, I have no idea what these things are. Sometimes I can know exactly what's coming in if it's a little slow, but uh, I literally got, like, a whole porch full of boxes uh, just recently, so... Holy cow. Okay. I guess we'll just dump this out. I'm guessing this was just a random bag lot. I've had kind of mixed success with that, if you've seen other videos. Some of them were really, really good. Some of them not so much. I do see old Grievous's cape, which is really cool in here. Uh, I think that is, it's actually in really, really good shape as well. So that's really awesome. Uh, you always find the white Grievous, this one, uh, but you never find his cape. His cape is actually pretty rare to find, and this is pretty mint uh, condition. You don't see any fraying or anything like that on it. So that's super cool. Uh, I did see something that just stood out to me here which is the Podracer old version of Watto from Watto's Junkyard. That is amazing. Uh, so that's like a $50 figure. I just have to find his body uh, in here, but that is probably the reason I bought it. If I saw that, <laughs> it would be my guess. Uh, this lo does look like just a total mix of stuff, so I'm probably assuming that it was probably pretty cheap, and I found that guy in there sticking out, maybe his wing or something like that, and uh, struck, struck in on that one. So <laughs> super good on that. We also do have... The Sebulba, the old version. I'm assuming we have, yep, we have the Beto from that same set. This weird looking 
Alder Beto. So all the old things from the pod racing sets, which is really cool. Looks like just a lot of really old Star Wars figs. <clears throat> uh, we do have, what's that bounty hunter? I always forget her name. Uh, it's the uh, changeling, jeez. It's not Zeb, that's the ghost guy. What is that? I'll think about this by the end. <laughs> it's the one that tried to assassinate Padme. Holy cow. Oh, so we actually have a Obi-Wan Kenobi and it's in awesome shape and it actually is a light up Kenobi and you can see his battery is working really, really, really well. So man, this lot is actually turning out really good. You can see with a saber, super cool. We got a sweet man array here. And along with that, a sweet sawfish, I guess you'd say. <laughs> I don't know, I don't remember what that was called, or what Lego called that. Got Han and Carbonite. We do have the Wookiee Catamaran guy, different legs, but uh, the Wookiee Catamaran rookie. Ooh, we do have Anakin as well. He is in awesome shape too. His light, though, does not work. So hopefully it's just a battery. Uh, I will try to replace the battery and see if hopefully that is enough to make him work. Because his cape's in really good shape as well. If you guys have never seen one of these, uh, you just push on their heads and their light up sabers light up there. But you can't replace their capes because their heads are attached, part of the actual mechanism. So you can never replace the cape. So really, uh, in terms of condition, it's the cape is pretty much the only condition thing you see. Uh, obviously, if they have dents and stuff like that too. But the cape itself, if it has fraying, nothing you can do about it. Can't change it for another cape or anything like that. Uh, we do have the red astromech there. It's got old Jar Jar. <laughs> Looks like Obi Wan in his uh, 70s days, I guess. <laughs> uh, really good shaped capes, which is really nice to find capes like that old kind of uh, maroonish brown color. Actually, have a, another one of the Wookiee Catamaran guys, Chewbacca. Here's old Jar Jar's body. There. Looks like we have an old Harry Potter body as well. That's always nice to find. We've got Maz Kanata. So I don't know where. <laughs> it's some new, some old. So it's kind of an interesting collection here. Uh, cause some are really ancient, ancient things, and then we have like Maz Kanata's, you know, from Takadana is really new. Uh, we have this little dinosaur here. The biggest backpack you've ever seen, fully loaded with a coffee cup there. I think we have Jar Jar Shield. I think most of the other stuff, if I see, we got an R2 body. This is supposed to be Luke, but wearing the wrong hair. Got another version of Obi. Some like knights and old vintage space guys. Let's see, I think that's Ginny's body, so that's probably the this Harry Potter thing we had. Jenny's body on Jar Jar, or Jenny's head on Jar Jar body. This is old school Jenny from the Chamber of Secrets, I bet, I'm guessing. Yeah, just the rest are just accessories and some uh, kind of older things. I don't think I see anything else super special in here. If you guys see something else in this lot, go ahead and tell me. I know it's a little bit far away for you guys to kind of really point out stuff. Looks like that's old Padme uh, as well. Had that really weird looking face. <laughs> Got Steven Spielberg, the director from the old Spider-Man sets. All right, let's move on. Super cool on that one. I've never had that old Watto, so really excited about that figure. Uh, let's see. So these two boxes were from the same guy. Uh, one I bought earlier, and then he posted some more stuff, and I bought the other stuff as well. A uh, really cool guy to work with. So we have a couple bags here, it looks like. I know some of these were, were uh, mismatched just because he was going through them and trying to sell them, and then his, his son, I guess, came in at the end and started helping him organize to actually put the bodies on correctly. Uh, we do have a Sand Green Horn Company troop. Got young Anakin from Pod Racing. 
got a Han Solo. This is supposed to be Anakin, um, different head, different hair, obviously. We have a Darth Vader. This looks like it is supposed to be Padme, or actually, okay, so these two, <laughs> two are kind of swapped. Uh, we have Princess Leia, uh, Padme's head, Princess Leia's hair, and then we have Padme's hair, Princess Leia's face, on a Hoth Trooper. <laughs> kind of an interesting look there. And we have old Chewbacca, got classic Luke, just a clone gunner. And it looks like a damaged Darth Vader. Does not wear a cape in this version. It's just one of those pilots, I think, a Naboo guy. Uh, we have a Gungan warrior. And then we also have a... Well, that's a, kind of mixed up, but uh, we have the ARF trooper. Wrong helmet, though. Like I said, a little mixed up. Uh, but that is fine. All right, the next ones we have in here, uh, we do have, so this is uh, Anakin's body from one of his Sith versions. I think I got the head in here somewhere, probably from the other box, uh, I would imagine, uh, from the other stuff I ordered. I saw that some of the mix match stuff was, um, you know, kind of separated between the two lots, so I made sure I bought both of them so that I could kind of put them all together. Uh, we do have Obi, long-haired version. We do have Palpatine's Arrest Palpatine, which is a great figure. Another red astromech in R2, the new version. Got Kit Fisto. He's one of my favorite figs. Uh, we do have <laughs> we do have Mace Windu pre hair loss. <laughs> uh, we got old Obi. And it looks like Count Dooku. I think this is the wrong body, but we do have uh, Stacey Tin from, with a Batman cape, <laughs> uh, from the Palpatine's Arrest set as well. We got that Air Arc Trooper. Doesn't have his pants. Uh, looks like we got a 501st. We got C-3PO. And Newt Gunray over here because they're all Star Wars. And we had a super battle droid in there. It looks like maybe, maybe a regular regular droid. This one looks like a Kashyyyk lot. So we did have one of the full Kashyyyk battle packs with those phase two guys and the kind of arc trooper style I guess. <laughs> those ones. Uh, and then just phase two helmets. So that full battle pack of Kashyyyk. We do have Commander Gree, the newer version of Commander Gree. We got the Wookiee. I think this is Tarful, if I'm not mistaken. We got two Rebel Commandos. And then we got the Clone Sergeant. I think Sergeant is green. Yeah. Clone Sergeant there. And then the other box to kind of complete what we're looking at. Obviously, they had Palpatine's Arrest set. I was trying to uh, buy all the sets to try to complete that minifig set, because uh, that does that's one of the most hard-to-get sets, so that sold really, really well. And so we have the lightsabers and stuff like that. Uh, so we do have the one I was really looking forward to. We have Agent Kohler from Palpatine's Arrest as well. Uh, we got an Ahsoka, Barris, and her master, Luminara. Now we do see we have the, you know, the not good Anakin body, but we do have the Palpatine's Arrest face, so we'll put that on, switch those two out, uh, and those will be two complete figs. We got Pong Krell here. Looks like we have another Kit Fisto. Probably one of these was from the Palpatine's Arrest, one of them was not. Got the Clone Wars version of Obi. The Mace Windu. Uh, this one, I think, I'm not sure which body that is. I think this is a Palpatine's Arrest set, 
or figure, but definitely wrong head. Uh, we do have Plocoon. And we have Obi. Tatooine. Obviously, that, I think that's Luke's body uh, with Obi's head. Old Obi. And we do have Yoda here as well. Gray-haired Yoda. So that's going to be it for today. I don't want to make this too long. It's already 15 minutes long, so uh, I will go through the rest of the stuff in the next video. Uh, if you guys did enjoy, hit that like button. Um, go ahead and hit that notification, and I would appreciate a subscription as well, uh, just to keep this going. Definitely appreciate the support from all you guys that have been watching the other ones, um, and I'll catch you next time.